into Bluetooth earbuds and headsets and all sorts of things, like maybe even hearing aids. Well, we'll, we'll get there in a minute. You've got to be sure and stay tuned to this next interview from CES because we've got the man himself. Always a pleasure to chat with our next guest. From Jabra, he's the Senior Vice President for Marketing, Callum McDougall. Callum, welcome back into tomorrow. How are you doing? I'm very well, Dave, and it's good to see you and the team here back at CES once more. Yes, indeed. Last year was all virtual, but we still chatted with you, but it's better always to talk in person. Absolutely, and it's great to be here once more and uh, plenty of new things to talk about. Oh boy, that's for sure. We went by the table at the Unveiled Press event and we thought, oh look, there's Column, And oh my gosh, there's new stuff to talk about, including new colors. And people are all about fashion. Why not, right? Absolutely. We bought a, a whole new range of colors this year um, for our new elite range, uh, ranging from our gold beige to new turquoise colors. And uh, yeah, people love them. They're, they're selling very well on the run up to Christmas and people are enjoying the different color choices, making their own fashion statements. Does that surprise you or is it a matter of you know that it kind of goes that way, right? That folks want to be different to some degree and why not be different with colored earbuds and their charging stations and everything? Yeah, I think we're seeing more of it now. Traditionally, people have chosen the the, uh, the neutral colors, the blacks and uh, perhaps the white products as well. But uh, more and more, I think people do want to make their own fashion statement and make their own choices and pick up something new and different. And we're certainly seeing that, or at least uh, it appeared in some people's Christmas stockings, as we would say in the UK. Yes, and we say that too in the US by all means. Now, the other great thing about the different colors is that there's a different set for everyone in the family. And they say, oh, no, those are mine, easily. Look at the color. Oh, OK, got it. That's exactly right. And I think uh, what we've really tried to do here is now bring a broader range of products, different prices, starting at $79 for the Elite 3, up to $199 for the Elite 7 Pro, different colors, as we've talked about, but also different functionality, our active range of products. If you want to work out, you have Elite 4 active or Elite 7 active, both designed to make sure they stay in your ears when you're running and they're durable or you can choose our top of the range Elite 7 Pro, best voice pickup in the market, great active noise cancelling, whether you want to listen to music or you want to work call. We've talked a lot about the active line, which is so important for so many people. And, and you don't have to be an athlete to get the real good joy out of the Jabra active earbuds. You just want to be somebody who doesn't want a problem with your earbuds, whether you're just going to the gym or doing a little run throughout the neighborhood, whatever the case. Is there anything in particular new this year with the actives? Yeah, the most important thing for an active earbud is that it stays in. You yes. want something that is comfortable and durable. And for the Elite 7 Active, we've invented a new technology that we call Shake Grip. And that is a new coating that goes around the earbud to make sure it stays in your ear. That's the, uh, the products that we have just here. Um, in, the, in the turquoise color we were talking about. So the combination of the Shake Grip, this kind of new small size, um, built on over 60,000 ear scans that we have, um, plus IP57 uh, rating uh, and a two-year warranty against sweat means that you know that this product will be durable and it'll stay in your ear when you're working out, whether you're in the gym or whether you're like me and you just walk the dog with them in. There you go, whatever it is, whether you sweat a lot or a little, the fact is that these actives will take good care of you. Absolutely, absolutely, and of course, great music as well, because yeah. many of us want to listen to music while we're working out. That's true. Oh, and if you need to make a phone call or answer the phone, that's an added benefit. Of course, you can, uh, you can have music and calls. That's what you need from any earbud, and that's the starting point as well, of course. For sure. Now, what are you introducing in addition here at CES this year? So we have a new product that we, uh, we announced earlier uh, last year, and now we're showing off for the first time at CES, called Jabber Enhanced Plus. And this is a product that brings together two parts of our company. In the Jabra brand, we make fantastic true wireless earbuds. And under the ReSound brand, we've been making hearing aids and hearing support systems in the US for some time now. There's 18 million people in the US who have mild and moderate hearing loss. They know it and they've not been able to do anything about it. Huh? No, I, no, I hear you. <laughs> I hear you by all means. And there's a further 34 million people with uh, medical um, hearing loss and have not taken an action. And we want to try and help those people by delivering them something different. So we've created a new type of product. A product combines the capability of a true wireless earbud with a hearing uh, technology as well. And that's Jabra Enhanced Plus. 
And as you can see there, Dave, it really is a small, discrete product. It's about wow, they are very small, so that you would want them for a hearing aid. I'm sorry, Chris, I'm probably moving all around talking, but he's trying to zoom in and show this, so do check out the video with Colm at intotomorrow.com. Tell me more about this one. Yeah, it's about half the size of a normal true wireless earbud, and each earbud, the one you're holding there, uh, weighs 0.11 ounces, or three grams. So it's light, it's comfortable, so you can wear it in your ear as often as you like. You can listen to music, you can make calls, but it also contains hearing aid technology. It will come with a companion application that will, uh, which will test your hearing, optimize the product for your hearing that enables you to, in the right occasion, um, uh, hear um, better, whether it's in the restaurant, maybe at work, or with you with family and friends. And they're so light that you don't even know you're wearing them, so except the, for the fact that you're hearing everything better, it's like, yeah, I've got my job right here, buds. That's the idea, something that is discreet, but visible and comfortable that people can wear when they want to help them be able to hear better when they need to be able to do so. And they're available now? Not yet, you'll see them coming later this year. Okay. And do we have a price yet in US dollars? We do not. Uh, it will be somewhere between the price of a uh, high-end earbud and a low-end hearing aid. So that's somewhere between 250 and just over $1,000. So, uh, but it's a new product line and we think it's a very important way to be able to help out millions of people in the US who need hearing support. Well, as always, you guys are coming out with cool new things to make not only our music life better, but now our hearing better. And it's certainly something we need to continue to talk to you about, by all means. Absolutely. And uh, it's great to be able to talk to you again at CES, Dave, and uh, show off the latest technologies that we have. Oh, for sure. Colm, thanks so much for joining us. As always, you want to visit Jabra.com, J-A-B-R-A.com. We'll get you there, of course when you visit us at intotomorrow.com and you'll see what Colm and his team are regularly up to. And of course, the announcement of all their cool new products and everything, do check them out. We'll get you there as well. We're back with more from Las Vegas and CES. I'm Dave Graveline. Stay tuned, you guessed it, right here on the Advanced Media Network.